What's going on everyone? I'm Devin with True Devin Gaming and today we're doing another Bloons Out Fence 6 video. Today we're doing the current Advanced Challenge and Daily Challenge. The Advanced Challenge is You Can't Beat by NWL. Uh, it's on the map firing range, hard difficulty, alternate balloon round as the game mode. The reward is 90 monkey money and a random instant monkey. You see, yep, firing range. You're only allowed one tower. And as far as the monkeys available, you're allowed a door as a hero, all the primary towers, all the military except for middle pass stub, can't go to tier 4 or 5, all the magic, and as far as support goes, we're missing the beast handler and we're missing the top pass tier 4 and tier 5 spike factory. Things to take notice here, we're doing this round 38, we're given 21,000 cash, one life, one monkey, saying that again. We're not allowed to sell, so once we place our monkey, that's it. Loon speed is decreased to 80%, uh, regrow is increased by a huge amount, so if there's any regrows, that sucks for us. We would have to possibly remove the regrow, and then ceramic health is at 2000%. Let's get this sorted. Uh, let's just press play and see what balloons show up first. Fine range has quite a long start of a track, so we can actually see a lot of balloons that come out. And I don't see any ceramics or Vigo, so those haven't affected us right now. What we did see is that there was purples, there was blacks, and there was leads. So we need popping power that isn't just explosive, isn't just magic, and isn't just sharp. Actually has to pop all those. My first thought is to go middle pass druid. Just because that's always a good idea for a simple test. And going top pass for the lead popping power. And let's leave it at first. Oh, so there's a rainbow balloon there. Is there going to be any other type of balloon shot? Ah, there's the ceramics. Just, just one we grow ceramic, and it's immediately killed like that. Okay, so we found the solution immediately. This, yeah, as Dead Boy Gamer say, advanced challenge. See, Blank is saying that they use Ace, so try with Ace. Sure, we'll try this advanced challenge again. Rewards, 90 monkey money, and a 023 beast handler. Let's try the advanced challenge again. Uh, which Ace did you use? And Elite says they use the glue gunner. A 420 glue. Dead Boy Game also said they use glue as well. Dead Boy Game also said they use a 250 sub that's not even available. Okay, but. You say figure out for. Which ace you used? I'm going to just try middle path. Yeah, middle pass is not it. Is this one map where Wing Monk is useful? We don't have monkey knowledge though.
Yeah, that's not working. I'm not trying out all the different aces, I'll try out the other suggestions first. So there's a glue gunner. I'll go top left. It was a... What is it? 4-2, was it? Yeah, 4 2 zero glue. Not one know what ace? Yes, I would want to know. And that missed. Maybe better placement would be required. Okay, there we go. Yep, a 420 blue gun, it does work. And then the last one that I was told about, besides the ace, was a 250 Buccaneer. You did glue in the right? You know, the issue with the glue for the first try I did was that I didn't target strong, I targeted first. So you said 250, so let's go to this location. Two times cash is allowed. So yeah. Pirate Lord is available to you, but not to me, so can't even tempt that. Let's just see if the 240 works. I'm not expecting it to work. Let's see, Elite said middle pass works for the ace but requires micro. Oh well, no, thank you for the micro. And yeah. The tier 4 does not work. Tier 5 is fine. Elite said tech tail work. Oh, Blank is saying they use Spectre. 2 times cash, by the way. Okay, yeah, that, that explains a lot. So the ace can't do uh, the bottom pass answer because don't have two times cash for the Buccaneer, same thing, middle pass option does not work because don't have two times cash. Okay, that was the advanced challenge. Let's go into a daily challenge, which is Act Tech by Magnus Aben. It's on the map Monkey Meadow, hard difficulty standard. Again, you say advanced challenge. Yeah, so the fact that we went to be the first try was our first out of place now. Now we read an advanced challenge there. Okay, awards, 80 monkey money, random instant monkey. Interesting. You allowed a hero, pack shooter, 444, so no tier 5s, and a 430 village. There's no limit on how many towers you can place, but you're allowed to go to round, it's to round 70. All that considered, let me switch heroes. To Geraldo. Geraldo just makes sense for this. And let's get this daily challenge started. Is a more like intermediate challenge for today's? Yeah. Look at this out. There we can solve his attack shooter there. And faster shooting. Twice. That's what we'll start off with. We have auto start on because we're not going to take this over here. Let's see. I believe Monkey Knowledge is on this time, right? Yes, it is. Okay, so that means Jordan will be. Uh, purchase at level 3 and immediately have the rare quincy action figure. So I'll save up to get Charter.
Actually, now that I'm considering, there's only tier 4s available, there's no reason to save up for him. We'll just get down Geraldo now. There's no reason to save up. And yay, we have the Pack Mule. We have ourselves a donkey with a mustache. Always amazing. Huh. Considering we're not going for... What do you want to call it? Not going for the Bear Quincy action figure. We'll just focus on getting ourselves more popping power now. And since this is the Tech Tech Challenge, I'm not going to be getting myself popping power with Geraldo. Just going to be using him for boosting the Tech Shooters. Let's get down this. Question is this tax shooter, should I go bottom pass or top pass first? I think bottom pass. Say this challenge is a super buff tower. Just be able to Yeah we can. We can buff this a lot. The only things from Jordan that we can purchase are things that add up icons on top of the attack shooter. That's all. Hello. Winfrey Rose. Try I'll just go with Rose. That's the easier way to think it. How are you doing? Okay, letting the camera loom go. Say Sentry Paragon works too for the Advanced Challenge. I feel like the Advanced Challenge has a lot of options for what would work. Okay, we need to get some lead popping power down immediately. Going for top pass tier 3. To refuse to call it the Sentry Champion. Ah, <sighs> damn it. I see waiting for you. Yep. Ah, losing some lives there. That's what we get for it's placing. Like things in the wrong order. At least now we have lead popping powers and camo, so we can continue upgrading this. I really should not have gone grow blocker. So you tanked around? No thanks. I'd rather keep the 100 at 100. I want to get radar scanner so I don't have to purchase candle detection again. But I feel like I need to purchase it right now anyway. Because we're going to get more candle blooms very soon. Never mind. Well, we can afford this. Yes. Got radar scanner so we don't have to buy that again. You have to live with the. Suffering of knowing you could have not lost lives. We managed to not lose lives, so that's good. The 36 is the camera ground. Oh yeah, you say v -tube. Oh no. Oh, you put the requirement, I'm not allowed to purchase anything extra from Jordo that doesn't apply things to the tax shooters like that. So can't purchase uh, the Biju potion.
Ah, great. Over. Yeah, we did lose some lives. All because I did things in the wrong order. The ability to reset the blade trap. Nope. Not gonna reset the ability. There you go, got overdrive now. Say one tower all pops challenge. I mean that is possible if I got down Geraldo and attacked you at the very beginning because then I would have got the bottle of Jerry's fire by the lead balloon coming out. I could have done that. But I didn't. Because I was thinking about getting the rare Quincy action figure, which I chose not to. Either way, we're already past around 40, heading to 50. We're decently far into the challenge now. Let's do some of these. Because we can. Bottle of Jerry Fries actually adds to this. For some reason. So you take it to round 100? I mean, we can. It might seem like a waste. That's because it is. Uh, but just go and grab Monkey Intelligence Field so we have an additional icon pop up on these. Because why not? There we go. I'm pretty sure Jungle Drums does not stack. But filling out the full upgrade. Options is still just a nice feeling. Even if it's just completely useless. What is that? Well done, my friend. Ah, let's get another top path. Thank you. Come again. And let's get another middle path. I can fit this into both, right? So, there we go. Barely to fit it to both. Quick, check the shop. Fabuloso, what is that? Uh, Thank you. Question is, is this enough for round 63? I think it is. Looks like it is. Ah, no, it's picking this one. Alright, in case anyone wondering why the Sweden flag, it's not because I'm from Sweden, or that I support Sweden, it's a support of PewDiePie. Always support PewDiePie. No matter how many years it is, just continue supporting him. I actually got this one with all of them, so... Should I go middle path or bottom path with this one?
I'll go for a bottom pack. So you can get all pops on a 204 overdrive for this challenge? Oh yeah. I don't doubt it. Actually, not a thing, but I do doubt it. I do doubt it. There we go. We beat the mount 70. Awards 124 monkey money and 210 beast handler. I don't think I'll take this to 100. So that was the advanced challenge and daily challenge. We went over a few possible options for the advanced challenge. Uh, daily challenge, just one run. So I hope you enjoyed.